Hi everyone, today I'm going to be showing you how I do flat iron curls going from this to this using my ISA Professional Titanium Hair Straightener. So it's really easy to get these curls. Um, all you need is the hair straightener. It comes with a heat protecting glove, but I don't really use it. Um, I use these more for when I'm curling my hair with the curling iron. A hair clip to clip your hair back some heat protecting spray and hairspray. So let's get started with the heat protector. Just do a few spritzes. This is Free Shape by KMS. It smells so good. Just spray your whole head. Now my hair was washed last night and I find that my hair is, my hair is easiest to curl once it's set in a little bit, maybe just about 24 hours. So I'm going to clip up the top half of my hair and my clips are from, um, what's the brand? Dry Bar. Here we go. Now this titanium hair straightener goes up to 450 degrees, has little buttons here for on, off, plus and minus, and you can see the heat over here. So getting started. I have my warm flat iron. I grab just about like a one or two inch piece of hair. Grab it right at the roots. I have it pointed upwards. I twist once, pull down, twist again. Continue to pull. Pull pretty slowly all the way up until the end. And sometimes, here I don't have to because look at that ringlet. But sometimes I'll kind of recoil all the way back up. So if I go really fast, kind of start really fast and kind of travel down like this. I feel like it's not really hot. I'll sometimes roll it all the way back up, kind of like your curling iron. Then just let them drop. Here I'll do the bottom bits first. Here we go. Grab the piece. I love these pointed tips on the end of the straightener because you can kind of pick right into your hair and it's just really sleek. Very sexy design in this shiny red. There is no rhyme or reason for direction, so depending on where I am on my head, I'll switch to a kind of forward turning or backwards turning. So here I'll turn forwards. And the shorter the hair, obviously the fewer times you can really kind of wrap the hair around the metal pleats. And then I already did this back bit, so pull down the second layer. I'll just do this one for now. This was the best way to style my hair when it was even shorter because with a curling iron, I feel like your hands are always right in the action. Here you can kind of remove your hands to avoid burning. For the front bit, I always curl backwards. Last piece, curl this one back. There we go. That's a nice one. And now once they're all curled, you can do a bit of hairspray. It's my favorite Fashion Work 12 from Red King. You can just kind of finger brush them out. So my flat iron curls are done. I'm actually going to use a bit of this brand new product called the Hair Razor from Cake. 
It's a texturizing dry shampoo. It sprays in this really fine purple mist, not mist, powder. It's a dry to wet to dry formula, so it kind of feels cooling. But it gives you insane volume and hold. So I'll just massage it in. I'll also link the Cake Beauty channel below where you'll see a few videos that I'm featured in along with a bunch of other boss ladies. So fun. So there we have some extra volume. My last hair straightener hack. If you have a wrinkly collar, this does the job. You can do your hair and your ironing in the morning. I always pull my clothes out of my closet at the very last minute and it's usually a huge fail. Or if you're hemming a pair of jeans or rolling them up, you can run your hair straightener right around that roll to make sure it's nice and flush. One of my favorite features is the swiveling uh, cord. It makes everything so much easier when you're doing your turning. It's like a total dream. The ISA Professional Titanium Hair Straightener retails for $130 online. I'll leave a link below where you can purchase it. I'm a huge fan. It's a great shape, so easy to use. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave any comments below. Let me know how you curl your hair, how often you do it, and especially how you extend the length of your style, how long you can keep it before washing because I'm always looking for tips. So I will see you guys in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.